hello everyone welcome back to our channel my name is Derek Dimax and in this After Effects tutorial I will show you how to make this kind of text elevator animation inside Adobe After Effects so if you're not yet subscribed please subscribe click that bell icon down there in order to get all notification when I upload a new video after saying that let's jump in the video so let's start by creating your project by going to file new project let's make um, 10 seconds okay. after that um, let's change here to portal and let's click here new text and let's type that so after that click control alt home to bring the anchor point to the center like this and then go to align click here and click here to align. so after that just click this uh, this and um, this word control D to duplicate it and then rename this by click and press enter the name to devil stroke and then bring it uh, down after that just add this one and just go to this zoom in come to character make sure the feel the feel of the color is turned off and then it remains with a stroke like this let's copy this code and change this color to white after that we have our stroke but seven pixels okay after that so what we have to do here is just we are going to add a new solid just click this one and then click here like that yes after that go back and click this uh, this uh this box to add uh, another another shape and make it like this and after that just click drag select this shape go to this menu and click here and change to this one when we admit this shape it will give us this animation okay after that just select these two shapes and then uh, click p to open position and then go to first keyframe add and then go here and click drag somewhere like here and after that go uh, several keyframes add and then go back to fourth and click all the shifts back to here and then mark all keyframes like that f92 is easy go to graph editor and make it something like this okay and now we have our animation so let's make a motion let's add a motion blur by clicking that then click here to add motion blur to the layer so after that let's close all the layers and yes it's cool so uh, the last thing we have to, to make our make motion uh, very interesting uh, so the rotation animation layers click p to bring back a position and drag them one and a half frame forward after that somewhere like here i think yes and then click s to bring scale so let's change the scale of this one so let's make the keyframe and then here make it to zero so it will come like this you know so okay 
after that then click again and change the rotation value click and go back change it to 200 like that so yes like that so mark these keyframes f9 to is easy go to graph editor and make the shape like this one yes so let's see yeah okay now we have our animation so thanks for watching make sure you like comment subscribe for more upcoming videos and that's it see you in the next video guys